The Anytone 878 UV2 Plus is the newest DMR handheld we carry at BridgeCom. It has some exciting features I'd like to share with you. Hi, I'm Cody, W3AMG with BridgeCom Systems. Today, I'll be doing a full unboxing of the Anytone 878 UV2 Plus. So let's grab our box and see what's included. So now we are going to unbox the brand new 878 UV2 Plus. So here it is. They've actually changed the box design. So it, it has a cool looking box now. It looks awesome. Uh, so we're going to open it up. Here we go, open it up inside. It's got a couple Anytone stickers. There we go. And then let's see, we have access to Bridgecom University. This opens up uh, and this will get you access to the, the $97 course completely for free. Set that aside. Then we have a user guide for the PTT button, instruction manual. Uh, we don't necessarily recommend this. We recommend using Bridgecom University. It'll get you on the air a lot faster. Set this stuff aside. And then next up in the box, we have the radio itself. There we go. I'll take this out real quick. Check that out. So it looks pretty much identical to the, uh, the older one, but you can see it does say it on the back. And there is a difference to differentiate it. D differentiate it. It has a green button now as opposed to the blue button. So we will get to that in a second. Now the, the biggest difference with this radio this radio now supports up to 500,000 digital contacts uh, to be stored in it. Now, the previous one would only support 200,000, and the actual contact list as of, as of a few days ago uh, was all the way up to 193,000. Uh, so it was almost at capacity. And this, you're gonna be set for quite a while at this point. Uh, it will also receive APRS. The old radios will only transmit APRS, and this one will actually receive it as well as transmit it. So let's set that aside, uh, open up the box. So here we have the programming cable. You'll need that to program your radio. Uh, let's see, here's a little USB cable and there's two micro USB ends. Uh, I imagine, yep, this is to charge the Bluetooth push to talk button. And if you opted to get a uh, Bluetooth earpiece, this will charge th that same simultaneously. Then here is the little strap for your push to talk button. You can strap that on there and strap it right on your steering wheel. And moving down, here we go. We have a belt clip for the battery. Comes with a little wrist strap. You could, looks like uh, you could strap that on the radio right here. Okay. Then here is the wall warp for our battery charger. Here is the actual charging brick itself. Uh, these are neat the way they work. I'll demonstrate that in a second. Then we have our antenna. There we go. Go ahead and screw that onto the radio. There we go. And then finally, let's see what else we have. Finally, we have the battery. So here's the battery. Go ahead and take it out of the box here. There we go. Open it up. And you can just snap that onto the radio like that. And there we go, we have the brand new Anytone 878 UV2 Plus. And then just to demonstrate the charger, I did want to show you something real quick. Uh, this is a neat feature of these chargers. Uh, some radios do this, but some do not. You can actually charge the radio as you would expect in the charger, like normal. Uh, but this is, this is the feature I really like. You can charge a battery in the charger too. So what I like to do is have a couple batteries. I'll keep one on the radio and then I store one in the charger. So it's always charged up, ready to go. And then when it comes time to switch it out, you just slap a new battery on. You never have to worry about having to charge up your radio. There you have it, an unboxing, an in-depth look at the all new Anytone 878 UV2 Plus from Bridgecom Systems. Now this feature pack radio just came out. So if you'd like to be one of the first people to get your hands on it, click the link down below. If you'd like to speak to one of our sales representatives, our number is also below. Thanks again for watching, 7-3.